2022 has brought us many amazing video games, and we compiled the top 10 of the best gems that this crazy year had to offer. Join me on this adventure of absolute joy. Starting strong at 10 of Chained Echoes, the 16-bit style JRPG is a wonderful love letter to Chrono Trigger, one of the best JRPGs ever made. Combat is turn-based to four characters and play at once, and you can tag team with someone else from your party, which is rare for this kind of game. Teammates can be swapped in if the other character is low on health or magic, but also use their own abilities and combo attacks. Wonderful music, a deep storyline and lovable characters make this a must play. You're just gonna leave me here in, in what, space? Everybody lives in space, including you. Nine is just hilarious and confusing from the start. High on Life is a comedic first person shooter game with action adventure vibes. Earth has been invaded by the malicious 3-3 drug cartel, who seek to use human population as drugs. You're a human bounty hunter and aided by a number of very rude living weapons, called Galatalians. The player must navigate the galaxy and hunt down the G3 drug cartel's leadership in order to save humanity. It's Rick and Morty meets Halo with a whole lot of swearing. The campaign actually well made and gameplay is very accessible, colorful, silly and entertaining. This game knows how to have fun. Knifey! Stab! Stab! Yes! More! More! I need more stabbing! Was an angel or a demon? At 8 we put Bayonetta 3. It's bigger, more extensive and crazier than the acclaimed previous part. Basically little has changed in this style and action game. The self-confident witch makes her way through horrific monsters, deformed creatures and other creatures in closed arena. So-called demon slaves are part of Bayonetta's arsenal. These are gigantic beasts that you can control directly or have them appear at the end of a combo with a precise push of buttons. It's a pure die-hard action game of slow motion, mind-blowing combos and perfect dodges. Jump in and start hacking. Enjoy! For others, not just for yourself. No secret, I won't unlock. Lucky 7 goes to Horizon Forbidden West. It continues the story of Aloy, half a year after events of Zero Dawn, who is sent on a quest to a mysterious frontier spanning Utah to the specific coast to find the source of a mysterious plague that kills all it infects, on a journey across the uncharted lands of the Forbidden West. New is underwater exploration, the maps are bigger, a new weapon system is implemented and you can now ride flying machines. Combined with even better illustrations and the same awesome voice acting making this a real 2022 highlight. Bright and colorful at 6 is Platoon 3. This Switch exclusive is just so much fun. It is not radical different from its predecessor, but boasts a lot of quality of life changes like a new lobby, more balanced weapons and a better character customization. Plus, the few things we didn't like about Splatoon 2 are all gone except Tenta missiles. They even managed to squeeze out even more FPS and better visuals out the Switch. Good multiplayer with co-op that stays fresh for many hours, there isn't just any other game out there, truly unique. My name is Guybrush Threepwood, and this is a story about the time I finally found the secret of Monkey Island. At 5 we are delightfully returning to Monkey Island, the legendary point and click adventure series that started in 1990 is back. It's very humorous, beautiful, polished and a well paced story stuffed full of puzzles that are both hilarious and challenging for anyone who loves a good adventure game. All our favorite characters are back. You once again play as the sweet, naive and lovable pirate Guybrush Streepwood, and this will be the story in which he finally discovers the secret of the Monkey Island. Maybe, yes, no. For anyone who played a Monkey Island game before, this feels like coming home. Without cause. Best way to describe number 4 is epic. God of War Ragnarok is a wonderful game. Whether you look at the story, the characters who carry that story, the structure of the worlds or the extremely fine gameplay, everything is good. If you have mastered the combat system and alternate between your weapons to your heart content and make use of various skills, God of War Ragnarok plays wonderfully. 
The story grabs you, surprises you every now and then, and captivates with ease until the end. A rock solid game with spectacular setting, a lot of variation and good side quests. That is one of the best games of the year for sure. Going while my flame still flickers. Opening the top 3 with Xenoblade Chronicles 3. The story of this action RPG is monumental, extremely detailed and has made grown men cry. It is one of the best love stories in a video game. That is all we will say about it as you just have to experience it for yourself. The first few hours are linear to set the stage and after that the world opens up and you get to explore this immensely stunning world. You will meet tons of interesting NPCs, battle well fought out enemies and really get to know and love the characters as you roleplay. To top it all off this game is a masterpiece supported by an amazing soundtrack, another Switch exclusive. You better listen up now, it's the face of your real enemy is the final act. The team stays on board to land down range. This is capture or kill. The second best game of 2022 is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. This is a worthy sequel to the acclaimed Modern Warfare reboot from 2019. It is again a traditionally complete Call of Duty thanks to the great multiplayer and an almost nostalgic single player mode. The game strikes a good balance between the chaos of a modern battlefield and details of being an effective soldier. At the same time this game got released the Warzone 2.0 went live as well, instantly creating one of the best free to play battle royale video games ever. We already put 60 hours in the game and we are not going to stop anytime soon. Special Forces, 141, they are your brothers now! Here are some honorable mentions. We fight not for glory or pride, but for survival, for the future. It comes at no surprise that we put Elden Ring on number 1. This game took 5 years to make and it shows. You play as a fully customizable character in a world full of monsters and demigods, struggling for control over the lands between after shattering of the Elden Ring. It's your job to explore the world, grow in strength, fight the mean baddie and claim his great rune to ultimately forge the ring. This almost endless world is full of rich detail, it's dark, beautiful, haunting and has gorgeous endless vistas that leave you breathless. Writer George R. R. Martin has really created something special here. This game can be quite difficult and that is just how we like it. A real action role playing open world masterpiece that is rewarding and exciting until the end. Watch his next video, it has some great games in it. I pray that the guidance of grace abandons you.